MLB Network's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. It's game one of the World Series between the Houston Astros and the Los Angeles Dodgers. It's the Fall Classic, game one of the World Series. Next. Drawing closer to the start of game one, let's join public address announcer Alex Miniak. And now, your 2028 Los Angeles Dodgers. Now here's a look at the Astros starting lineup. Dan Plezak, who are you focused on? Well, Matty, they got to love the production they're getting out of the leadoff spot right now. He's an imposing figure with a bat in his hands, always seems to turn in a good at bat, and he can do a lot of damage when he barrels up the ball. All right, guys, here's the defensive alignment for the Los Angeles Dodgers. And folks, I'm locking in today on Ramon Laureano. His calling card, 2018, he burst on the scene for the Oakland A's with one of the best throws I've ever seen in Anaheim, throwing an absolute rocket to first base to snag an out. That is third, the third baseman. Number 87. First pitch on its way. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Marks is in pursuit. He can't make the play as it hops over the wall, and that's a break for the defense as it's going to keep the runner from first from scoring. Off the bat, it looked like that might bring their first run of the game across, but those hopes ended quickly when it hopped over the wall. Everyone gets two bases on a ground rule double, so the runner from first is, is forced four. to stay at third, the and the fielder. next guy is going to have Johnny. to be the one to put them on the board. Yeah. The one two is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Two men on, two out, and Got that'll it. bring up the LSU product, Alex Bregman. Alex Bregman. Alex Bregman. Payoff pitch on its way. And he takes ball four. So now at least they're set up for the force at any base here with two away. At this rate, he's going to set some kind of a record for walks issued in a game or he'll get an early hook. We'll see if he can settle down here and start to find the strike zone or if he continues to struggle. Batting six. The right fielder. Alex. Goes to go. nightmare start to the game and the nightmare continues as he walks in a run here in the first the wheels are not completely off the bus but they're definitely wobbling we'll see if he can limit the damage going forward so stepping in Ramon Laureano and the Dodgers with an opportunity for more here in the first here's the 1-1 one -one. Now this is on the ground a second. Is he going to get out of this? Over to first. He does get out of it, and the inning is over. So it's one run, one hit, no errors, and they leave the bases loaded. On to the second now at Dodger Stadium. Dodgers lead this one, one to nothing. Strike. 
Riding in, number 87. Now will swing it from the left side right here. Well, if you're looking for pop, he definitely has more pop, more home run potential hitting from the left side. This is his power side. First delivery to him on the way. In the air to straightaway right. Sanchez has it in his sights. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Ready for another chance. Yeah, Number 87. Number one for two with a double on his line thus far. Now a move over to first and a dive, but he's back. Here comes the first pitch. And he connects with it. This one's hit deep out to left center field. Gone! Big Dog's got to eat. So a two-run shot to left center. His first homer here in the series. And it's a 5-3 game now. We were wondering who was going to strike first with the long ball. What a moment for him right there. Home run the World Series. No one can ever take that away from you. Coming to the plate now, number yeah, 87. He's number two 87. for three with a home run and a double. The last at bat, Matty V, we heard this guy's a good fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pitch him a little bit differently this time and mix in some off-speed pitches. High and away on the first pitch fastball there. It's ball one. Hard hit ball towards the hole. And a base hit into left field. So they've got themselves a one out base runner. Hey, this guy's obviously seeing the ball right now. That's another hard hit single. Three for four right there. He's looking super solid at the plate. And next will be the Dodgers cleanup hitter, Johnny Pena. He'll look to bounce back after Johnny. striking out his last time up. Yeah. yeah, he's got to put that one behind him, especially with runners in scoring position. Those punch outs will stick with you a little longer. And he will hasten his way back to first where he's in there safely. And that'll bring up the former now first Alex. rounder, Alex Bregman. Alex Bregman. Here comes the nothing and two pitch. Now here's one hit in the air to the right side. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. Leave one. You might think it's just another win, but it's awfully hard to win in this game, especially on the road. But they find a way to get it done, and they should be very happy with this performance. And fellas, when you're on the big stage here at the World Series, you want to make sure you bring the A game. And this man right here certainly did. He's our tops player of the game. And Maddie, I think you're absolutely right. Some guys just seem to thrive under the bright lights of the World Series while other guys fade into the background. He was brilliant in this one, and this is some well-earned recognition. 
nine to three the final tally here in this one. The Strohs win the World Series opener and take a one nothing lead. Hunter Harvey is credited with the win. So that's a wrap for us here tonight for my partners in the booth Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and Heidi Watney on the field. This is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB Network. Have a good night everybody.